What makes cats barf so often? Cats, those enigmatic and graceful creatures that share our homes, have fascinated humans for centuries. Their behaviors, habits, and even their biological processes are subjects of curiosity for many pet owners. One common question that often arises is whether cats have periods, similar to human females. The answer lies in understanding the feline reproductive cycle, a fascinating and intricate process that sets them apart from humans. Let's explore the world of feline estrus, commonly known as being in heat, and unravel the mysteries behind this natural phenomenon. 1. The absence of menstruation. Unlike human females who experience a monthly menstrual cycle marked by the shedding of the uterine lining, female cats do not have a comparable process. Cats do not menstruate in the same way humans do. Their reproductive system operates differently, and they do not undergo a regular monthly cycle. 2. Understanding estrus, heat, in female cats. What is heat? Instead of menstruation, female cats go through a reproductive cycle known as estrus or being in heat. This cycle is essential for their ability to reproduce and involves distinct behavioral and physiological changes. Unlike humans, cats do not have a set schedule for their reproductive cycle. Instead, their heat cycles are influenced by various factors, including daylight length, the presence of other cats, and environmental factors. Signs of heat. Vocalization. One of the most noticeable signs of a cat in heat is increased vocalization. Female cats become exceptionally vocal during this time, often yowling and meowing loudly to attract male cats. Restlessness. Cats in heat may display restlessness, pacing around the house, and exhibiting signs of agitation. They might also become more affectionate or demand attention from their owners. Positioning, a cat in heat assumes a unique mating position, elevating her hindquarters and treading her back legs with her feet. This position is an invitation to male cats for mating. Increased affection, some cats become more affectionate during heat, seeking more attention and affection from their owners. 3. Reproduction and pregnancy. During the estrus cycle, if a female cat mates with a male cat, she may become pregnant. Unlike many other mammals, female cats are what are known as induced ovulators. This means that they do not have a regular ovulation cycle. Instead, ovulation is triggered by mating. When a female cat mates, it stimulates the release of eggs, increasing the chances of conception. If mating is successful, the female cat will enter gestation, a period of approximately 63 to 65 days during which the fertilized eggs develop into kittens. This remarkable process marks the beginning of a new life, a cycle of birth, and the continuation of the feline species. 4. Responsible Pet Ownership Understanding the intricacies of the feline reproductive cycle is not only fascinating but also crucial for responsible pet ownership. For those who do not intend to breed their cats, controlling the feline population through spaying and neutering is highly recommended. Spaying, the surgical removal of a female cat's reproductive organs, not only prevents unwanted pregnancies but also offers health benefits, such as reducing the risk of certain cancers. Neutering, the equivalent procedure for male cats, not only prevents them from impregnating females but also curbs behaviors such as roaming, aggression, and marking territory. Spaying and neutering contribute significantly to controlling the cat population, preventing overpopulation, and ensuring a better quality of life for individual cats. 5. Conclusion. In conclusion, while cats do not have periods akin to humans, they experience a unique and intriguing reproductive cycle marked by periods of heat. Understanding and appreciating this natural process not only enriches our knowledge of these wonderful creatures but also guides us in responsible pet care. As responsible pet owners, it is our duty to provide our feline companions with the best possible care which includes making informed decisions about their reproductive health. By appreciating the marvels of the feline reproductive cycle and making responsible choices, we can ensure a healthier, happier life for our beloved feline friends while also contributing to the overall welfare of the feline population. So, the next time you observe your cat displaying signs of heat, remember that it's a part of the natural cycle of life, a testament to the beauty and complexity of the animal kingdom.